Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Mad Dog Fishing. Uh, I really appreciate it. Anyway guys, this upcoming video is basically me venting my frustration. I had a boater this weekend that uh, basically ran over five of my lines. He was 50 yards off the beach. And in the video, it, it may look like he was further, but he was not. I mean, I could literally wade out 25 yards. And, I mean, not only did it run over my lines, but it ran over three or four other fishermen's lines. I don't know if any of them got cut off or not. Then he had the balls to go anchor out about 100 yards down the beach. And I had a good mind to go down there and give him a piece of my mind, but, it, you know, it just it just wasn't worth it. And I thought it was a done deal, but when he, when he got ready to leave, what did he do? Went right back over my lines again, and I lost it. I, re I literally did. Thankfully, the video wasn't on showing me being an ass, but it it is what it is. Uh, and, and I put up with a lot of stuff out here fishing. We all do. Whether you're on the pier, out in the boat, or on the kayak, or on surf fishing. I mean, every once in a while, you just get that jerk that just, it, it, it respects no other person but themselves. But anyway, guys. I'm sorry about the language. Uh, if, if if foul language offends you, you might not want to watch the video. There's a little bit of cursing in the end. Uh, just me venting my frustration to the camera. But as you can see, this guy, he was literally 50 yards from uh, the beach. And there's just no, no sense in that. I mean, there's I'm a boater, I'm a kayaker, and I have respect for other people. Whether they're fishing off the beach or fishing in another kayak near me or in another boat near me you know I, I just have respect and this guy did not he uh, you know he made a point when he came back across to run across my lines and I mean it was a done deal the fishing was bad that's what I'm blaming it on you know I didn't catch any fish so it didn't help that he was running up and down the beach either so anyway guys check out the video and uh let me know what you think. Well, I don't like the conditions. Yeah, that's that's not good. We need some some heavy chop, but anyway, like I said, I got mad dog skills, so it shouldn't be a problem. But we're gonna get some baits pretty far out there today. Y'all see that ship boat 50 yards offshore gonna run right across our lines? That, my friend, is an asshole. Guys, sorry about the language. I mean, I just, I was, I lost it. I mean, literally, I lost it really bad later on. And I'm usually not like that. I'm really a laid back guy. And 
you know, I, I, I let a lot of stuff roll off my back, and but that morning, it just, when somebody's blatantly doing something, it's just uncalled for. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching the video. Uh, if you got any comments, leave them below. And, you know, if you got any questions, you know, be free to ask them. And don't forget to like the video. And if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and subscribe. I promise you, I'm not always crying and whining about other fishermen. Uh, you know, we, we're going to put up some good fishing videos this year. Uh, hopefully next weekend the fish will be back on. It's a full moon this weekend. There were a few fish being caught, but, you know, I didn't find them. Anyway, thanks again.